unforgettable experience. Um, we were staying on the third floor up there, down that uh, corridor there, in room number 371. It was very nice, absolutely beautiful room. And uh, plenty of uh, room in the bed. I think it's a queen size bed. We'll have to get one. That is the uh, restaurant area. I don't know who those two strangers are. They look up to no good. I'd have them arrested immediately. They look like they're going to rob that telephone box. The one with the pink shorts especially looks a bit dodgy. Yeah. I'd have uh, immigration sort them out now then there's a, a rather dodgy looking lady coming here now. Which is saying that she's going to have another go at the telephone box now. Maybe, maybe not. Mm, suspicious. I would, um, I think I would dial 911 and get the law enforcement officers out there to arrest them. We're on the way now to pick the rest of the uh, passages up that were swimming with the dolphins at 12.45 and then after that we leave for Orlando. on my ear that's the end of you it's 103 degrees outside welcome to Key Largo
to the uh, Dolphin Plus place again now to pick up the uh, other passengers. She goes, I can speak well. Ooh. Name that sheet, Dory. Dory, Dory, yeah, yeah, Dory. Dory, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just. What's funny though is that all the people that were going, ooh, 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 like that, there's a video camera. Why don't they make the whole plane out of that? <laughs> Friday will be mostly sunny, 50% chance of showers, thunderstorms in the morning, and partly cloudy, and the same chance of the afternoon highs. The airboat, all that good stuff? Good, because this is kind of where I use my reverse psychology, and since everybody said good, this is where I pass out the questionnaires now. <laughs> All right, now the questionnaires are real simple. What I'm going to do is I'm going to attach them to a clipboard. It's pretty much one per family, okay? Uh, I do have a limited amount. If I have any extra ones and anybody feels like writing anything, just come and see me afterwards. I'll let you know how many I have left. Um, they're real simple, okay? All you have to do, name, today's date. What, what yeah. So it's July 28, 2012. Um, uh, put your holiday company as well. Okay, what company that you booked your holiday with? For my Americans, if you did it either Expedia, Viator, Alcatraz, whatever you booked it through, just put that Viator, just put that um, where it says holiday company. Then on the spot, on the very bottom, there's a spot that says additional comments. So if you like writing anything, by all means, okay? Um, right above it, though, it says most important and it's got a dot 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 and then it says did you have fun i disagree i think the most important question on that questionnaire is knowledge and friendliness of staff <laughs> that would be me all right if you had a good time danny will spielberg <laughs> steven spielberg over here and then uh if you didn't have a good time remember one pay little bit of the silva plums and 27p <laughs> all right so i'm gonna pass those around we're off okay we are gonna make a rest stop will feels like being nice today so we're gonna make a little well he's not gonna fall down on it was he? <laughs> give me a hug come on come on um we'll fill those out we'll make a rest stop same stop that we did uh should the, <laughs> should take us about uh, like five six hours to get there 15 hours, I don't know, something like that. When we get closer, I'll let you know. What we'll do is we'll finish watching the rest of um, Platoon. Where are we watching? In the Army now, right? In the Army. We'll finish watching the rest of that. And, <laughs> I don't know if it's you or the snake. Or, or me.
me or the snake. I don't know. Uh, so we'll get that going. So just kind of sit back, relax, all right? Remember, restroom in the back if you guys need to use that. AC vents up here, on, off if you're hot, cold. How are you guys doing in the back back there? Because I know sometimes it takes a little while longer to get some air back here. It's all right. <laughs> Nothing to what? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Now there's, for those in the front, he said, "Oh, now that you come back here, there's a lot of hot air." <laughs> Nobody else laughed at that. Neither did I. <laughs> but, <laughs> that's okay. So, but before we go home, before we go home, do you guys, or before I start this movie, do you guys want to play a quick little game? I like to play a game. It's kind of like a, a trivia game, kind of, just to see what you guys learned today and stuff like that. And yesterday, it's kind of going to go over. But what I'm going to do is I call it the battle of the genders. It is going to be the men versus the women, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Somebody likes that back there. We're going to see. Now, I, I know women. Women are smarter. Huh? Newlyweds. <laughs> Newlyweds, that's right. Now, I, I, I've had the pleasure of meeting a lot of women, and, and I agree that they are smarter than we are, so nobody even clapped for that, huh? <laughs> now, one girl clapped. All right. <laughs> women are smarter. Oh. Huh? You guys knew that already? Yeah. You, you're, you're trying to say that you're smarter than a creature, that every time he takes down his underwear, he tries to flick him up in the air with his toes and catch him in the air. <laughs> it's it's the real smart. All right, well, what we're going to do, I'm going to cover the rules real quick, okay? The rules are... When I say only the women can answer this question, only the women can answer the question. When I say only the men can answer, only the men can answer the question. I'll award the points and stuff like that. Um, if I hear anybody say, I say it's only the women, if I hear a, uh, a man answer the question, the, even if it's right or wrong, the women automatically get the points, okay? And vice versa. Does that sound like a plan? Yeah. Everybody agree? Yeah. Everybody has to agree. Yeah. Everybody agree, all right. Since uh, since I'm a nice guy, and uh, and I, I want ladies to go, ladies always go first. Okay, so we'll start off with the ladies, and we'll start off with a little scientific here, mathematical scientific. It pretty much doesn't have anything to do with the trip, but uh, I'm gonna give you guys an easy one in the beginning. All right, only the women can answer. Only the women can answer. What famous scientist invented E equals M C squared? Albert Einstein. Correct. All right, half a point, because the real name is Albert Wolfgang Einstein. So the women get half a point for that one. <laughs> she got smacked. <laughs> How about you're smarty? You should have worked that out. <laughs> All right, that was kind of a tough one. I know. It's Albert Einstein. Half a point for the ladies. All right. Next question is for the guys. Only the guys can answer this one, and I'm going to give you guys a tough one. Okay, because I, like I said, I know we're going to try to beat the women. So only the guys can answer. This is going to be a mathematical question. A mathematical question. <laughs> He's not moving anywhere. All right. Guys, all ready? Yeah. If one plus one equals two, two plus two equals four. All right. That's three points for the guys. All right. That's three points for the guys. They're up by half a point. What? You guys all agreed? You guys agreed with the rules? All right, all right, whatever, whatever. All right, guys are up three and a half, three and a half. Next question is for the ladies. Next question is for the ladies. And this is going to be a two-part question, okay? Two-part question. Okay, how many characters, this is going to be a movie question, okay? A movie question. How many characters were in the movie Monty Python's Flying Circus and name them? <laughs> Let's go, I want to start hearing things. How many how many characters were in the Mike, Mighty Python Flying Circus and name them? John Cleese. 48, John Cleese. There, John Cleese was already said. How, how many characters were there? 48. 48. Mike, there's only five. Oh wait, oops, no. <laughs> okay, so there's John Cleese. Michael Palin. Michael, okay, whatever. You, you can say whatever you want because I really don't know the answer. James. Mickey Mouse. And Minnie Mouse. All right. All right. So we'll give the ladies two points for that because there's a two-part question. So the guys are only up by half a point. Guys are only up by half a point. You guys don't sound too excited. What's going on here? All right. 
Next question is for the guys. Now, I'm going to give you a little history question, okay? And I know you guys are all from the UK, huh? I'm not cheating. Um, this is for the guys. Two, no, they got, okay, yeah, two and a half to three, two and a half to three. Two and a half to three is the score. All right, these are for the guys, all right? It's going to be a history question, and it's pretty much, okay, my American family, you can't answer the question, okay? Because you're American. Now, I'm going to give them an American history question. For the guys, everybody pay attention. For the guys, what color was George Washington's white horse? <laughs> right! All right, that's two points! No, 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 no. There's no such thing as a white horse, the gray. Dude, you're on the guys' team. What are you doing? Sorry. All right, all right, the guys get two more points for that. Right. Way to go, guys. Way to go, guys. Now, since, since you know the ladies, there is a prize involved at the end, all right, so I'll make it a little more competitive. Since, uh, since the guys are up, I already lost count. What I'll do is uh, I'm going to throw up. This is a free throw question. Anybody can answer the question, okay? Any First person I hear, first gender I hear, 10 points. Either the guys blow the girls out of the water or the girls come back and blow the guys out of the water, all right? So everybody pay attention. What's the category? Are you guys ready? <clears throat> what is a 22? What is the driver's name? Will. Will. Will! I heard it here. She said it first. Will, the ladies win. Yeah. The ladies win. The ladies win. They killed us, guys. They killed us. They killed us. You didn't even say anything. <laughs> huh? huh? All right, so the ladies won. So you guys want your prizes. All right. Your prize, since it's still kind of early, we should get back kind of early. Your prize tonight, okay, is that you have to take your better half out to dinner tonight. <laughs> and you have to pay for it. And as they're eating, you have to cut their food for them. You have to feed them. And after each bite, you have to wipe their mouth. Yeah! Sometimes it pays to be the loser, huh? All right. Well, enough joking around. Sit back, relax. We'll pass out those questionnaires. We'll pop in the movie and uh, go to sleep. By the time you wake up, we should be at the rest stop. Oh, where'd my snake go? <laughs> All right. Here it is, guys. Here it is. Outstanding job. It wasn't a job for a sergeant. It was an adventure.